it's me again. And I know I'm not birded up right now. I'm like really tired. <laughs> I'm like passing out. I'm watching like, I guess, videos of people gambling at casinos and relaxing. That's what I like to do. I like to watch people like, you know, play the slot machines for some reason. It's, it's you know, they start out with big money. So they're like, oh, let's put 20000 on this machine. Let's go. Woo. So, uh, this video, I thought I would update you guys. I would show you the process of how you check if the wells have been completed or not. Because I was getting lots of messages about particular wells and if they were completed. I checked these websites. Um, I try to check them out twice a week. The Railroad Commission sites. I'm going to show you how to search on the Railroad Commission site for those well completions. And then you can see if this is the API number of the new wells that we need. Or is this one of the older wells that were refiled. Which isn't a bad thing because it, you know, it shows you that there's oil on it. It's just not the news that we're looking for, alright? We're, we're waiting on four particular uh, wells to be completed. I'll list those. Let me list those. These are the six wells that we're waiting on the completions. Remember, always check the API number on these wells. Um, because some of the wells... There's multiple wells on the pad, so they'll have like Ma University Maverick One, you know, Rich A11, one or two, B Flying B, B10, right? Is this B10 number one or B10 number two? So check the APIs. This is the list. A lot of them have the same first number because it's all Hudspeth, so check the last few digits. So we have 281, 282, 283, 284. Those are the four new wells. And then the recompletions. 279, 277. Again, this is just showing you how to check for that uh, because I guess good or bad, um, you know, I don't want to be a bear of bad news or anything, but good or bad, I'm here to present, um, you know, it, I just find this whole thing interesting. So uh, let's get into it. Let me show you how to search those sites. Okay, here I am. This is like my old school YouTube video. So we're on the Railroad Commission online system, the oil and gas data query for drilling permits. And if you check Hudspeth County and you do a status date, newest, first, oldest. So there's not too much going on in Hudspeth, hence you'll find the torchlight property really easy doing that method um so if you look there are okay there's one two three four five six some of these have the same um API numbers. So here's, like I talked about in my earlier videos with Smokey, always look at the API number of the well. That's like your social security number of the well. Because some of these wells, like University B10, you know, it, number one or number two, right? Same as University Maverick, A24, number three. Now, number three, <clears throat> look at that. Two two nine. Basically, look at the last few digits. Two eight four. Two eight four here. All right. That's a new drill, and we got two completions, right? So here's University Rich A twenty four. That's a new drill. And then if we go down here, let's see here. We get into some older stuff. But look at all these university. Well, here we go for Maverick. These are the Maverick permits. So Maverick and Hudspeth. Maverick is doing the drilling, so you're going to find a lot of the stuff. But basically, so there you go. University Rich A24. There's three of them, by the way. There's quite a lot of University Rich A24s. 
Um, look at the API number 281, 283, 284. All right, and here's about on this website for the oil and gas completions. Records found, so if you search, um, these are all the old wells. Like I said, check the API number. Um, these are the tracking numbers. So what he was talking about was he posted University Maverick A24, and if you go to this, um, so if you go to this, you can go to a whole bunch of stuff for this particular well. And if you click on this W2 here, basically it takes you to this guy. Here's the whole document he was talking about, which he abridged out quite a few things. Um, so yeah, it's the date, but like I said, look at that API number. 229-30278, okay? And it said here, it was recompleted in, or completed in, you know, October 5th, 2019. And there's a whole bunch of different reports on this. You can look. Uh, and here's what Clint shows also about the, you know, yes, they encountered oil at these particular depths, at these particular geological formations. The Wolf Camp, Sandstone and Pen. We can, copy, we can contact Linda Johnson for further details. Sorry guys, my lips are like super chapped. I rode my horse and it was like so windy and the sand and the arena, I took her, I trailer her up to an arena to go practice and get lessons from a teacher, and I'm just like, am I, my lips are so chapped, so sorry about that, but look at this, okay, look at the, at the API number 30278, and if you go back, to the drilling permit queue, uh, as we talked about, there is a University Maverick, but it's not 7-8, it's 8-4. That's one of the new ones. 8-4, not 7-8. Let's find 7-8. Sorry, let's find 7-8. There's 7-9. Let's find 7-8. There we go. 7-8, University Maverick A24. That's the first one. That's the first one. Here we go. 7-8. Look. 30278. There's that number. Right? You can go here. 30278. <clears throat> Look, those numbers match. So, yes, they did find oil. Is this one of the wells that we're waiting on? No, it is not. This is an older well which did not have any uh, new permits filed for it. All of the wells listed on this current queue are basically what was transferred over, it seems, from uh, Old Torchlight to New Hudspeth Operating LLC, from Old Hudspeth to New Hudspeth, uh, in preparation for sale or spinoff. So, um, like I said, it does, while it's good news for oil and those people who want proof of that they found oil and they said that they were going to go out there, yeah, it shows that they found some oil. However, uh, it is not one of the wells we are waiting for the completion to uh, happen. This, like I said, was an older well. So I hope this helps, guys. Talk to you soon. Bye.